you adopted this dog, you are responsible for its health, its well-being. Taking care of it is a part of that. And unfortunately, you might go through an operation, they might not quite be the same dog, but just like any other family member, you don't just throw them away. Hey, my name is Brittany Roach. I'm a philosophy student at El Paso Community College. I wouldn't say I have one steady form of ethics because it's situational. It has ebbs and flows depending on what that may be. But I try to be as moral as possible, whatever that may be during that situation. I adopted a dog about six years ago named Abby Rose. She's a schnauzer I got from the pound after my previous childhood dog had passed. So she already had a big significance to me. Um, I had her for a few years. I noticed she had a big lump on her stomach and I wasn't sure if it, she had a tumor or what because my previous dog was also a schnauzer and they're prone to that. So I took her to the vet, found out she had a hernia that she needed to have surgery on because it was rather large. They put her skin back together with glue. They had burned both her sides when they uh, shaved for her incision. So she was pretty miserable for about three weeks. And she in turn made sure everyone else was miserable with her. <laughs> she had a cone on her head. She would run into us purposely. She was very defiant. Um, it affects me and my boyfriend all right, we lived in a very small apartment, so it was already kind of hard for her to get around in mobile. Um, so when we had her and her attitude changed, she no longer seemed to want to be with us. We decided that maybe it would be best that she found another home where she would be more comfortable and happier because she no longer seemed happy with us. It was something I really had to go back and forth on. Uh, I felt that Deciding to keep her was the best choice because of all this stuff that we've been through before. She had been a great dog up until that point. So I just worked with her until she came out of it. Once she started feeling better and she started uh, healing and recuperating, her previous attitudes came back and she was more of her old self. Had I had made the opposite decision, I think I would have regretted it because I would have missed it on the great dog that I have now. I think it's a struggle for some people because, you know, the fiscal responsibility of pets isn't the fur, like the foremost thing that you think about. You think about having this little dog or cat or whatever there to play with, but you are responsible for its health, its well-being. Taking care of it is a part of that. And unfortunately, sometimes it comes with some medical bills and you might go through an operation and they might not quite be the same dog, but just like any other family member, you don't just throw them away. Think about why you decided to adopt or whatever similar situation may be. Think about what drove you to make that decision and understand that it's not always gonna be good. There's some trials and tribulations that come with it and you have to write them out because you decided to take something on like that. You move forward, you try to figure stuff out and you work towards a good solution for everyone involved.